How's it going, guys? Moonman Zero back again once again for some more Resident Evil 2. And we are back where we were last at, right before the save. And, uh, heard some grumbling in that room. I was hoping nothing, nothing could get in here. I wonder if I can close that. Um, but, uh, either way, we're back here to check on Marvin, which is probably a brain eater at this point. Then I need to go back and grab a couple things after going over here and putting some stuff up in our box. Let's put our scepter up. If we need it, we can come back for it. Uh, this is kind of handicapping us by putting it up, I guess, but we're going to put it up just because I don't want to waste it, plus uh, it's taking up room. Put the shotgun up there. We're going to keep this for safety's sake because it only takes one more try and it'll be gone anyway, but better safe than sorry with that. Still only need the one healer right now. I don't want to grab any more. Maybe if we find a boss fight, die to it, and then come back, then yeah, I'll come and get it. Alright, let's check on... Dead Marvin. Or oh wait, he's laying there. Still alive. Oh, he's just sleeping, huh? That's lucky for him, I guess. I don't know how he can sleep in this situation, especially when I've just opened a giant door that leads to zombies that can come eat him. But um I guess we're safe in here no matter what? I don't- I, I can't be positive. Uh, can, can I close this, or is it just open now? I think it's just open now, okay. Let's go grab that, uh... Gunpowder and stuff. I don't know where that guy came from. He had to be the one I shot in the head on the ground, or something. So squeaky with the doors. That guy's probably still at the window, so he'll start banging on it as soon as I come over here. Yeah, I see him. Okay, so the gunpowder was right over here. I'm just double checking everything, make sure I didn't miss anything. Sorry about that. I just kind of had a uh, sneeze. All right. Um, there's nothing else. Oh yeah, I needed this. I was like, was there nothing else in here? Yeah, there was. Which for speed's sake, I should probably go back around upstairs to get there because I don't know what I'll run into up there. And at the moment, I have really no ammo. I'm gonna go combine this gunpowder with what I find and see if I can make some ammo. But other than that, we do not have much, which is not good. We're gonna grab one of these, take it out, combine these two, make some bullets as I'm low. And I know where that goes. We're gonna go put it up, and then these are helpful for other areas. I know an area that could be very helpful for the... Um, room where in the demo we found the arms locker key. I can't imagine where that's going to take us, but we are going to go check it out, because why not? But first, let's go use this little wheel here. Try to open up this probably terrible option gate. Like, sounds like such a good thing to open. Hopefully there's not a lot of zombies in here. I mean, it is a second floor. I don't know where they would have come from. There's no windows they should be able to reach. But, you know... Probably wrong. I'll probably they'll probably find something to reach me. Oh hey bud, where did you come from? Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from, Cotton Eye Joe? Why do you take so many dang bullets? There's one coming up behind me now, isn't there? Yep. You dead now? Nope, you're not. Okay. Now are you dead? Nope, you're not. Okay. You bet. What the? This isn't good. I've already used all that ammo. Missed a, a, a kill's worth of shots. Okay, stop going fast. Shit. We got about enough to kill you, maybe? I'm just gonna run over here now. You just calm down and uh, just calm down, sir. Let's try this. I just finish it with a knife. Get out of here. Get out of here. Ow. Get off me. 
I cut your arm off? Looks like I cut your arm off. Richard did not have one. Okay, well, you're definitely dead, but I have no ammo. That's good. That's good. You guys need to drop ammo. For standard edition, I am just mowing through ammo. I mean, I I did waste like four shots there, but still. Just the standard zombies take so many bullets. Okay, well, let's go ahead and open this and regret I ever shot at these guys. I have to do a lot of running, I imagine. Nope, this doesn't go there? Huh. I mean, I guess it looks like a crank there, but I assumed. Well, I know where it goes other than that, then. It goes to that steam room up in the, uh, up in the bathroom. So I came over here and wasted bullets for no reason. I mean, I would have eventually maybe had to clear them. But, uh, that, hopefully that explosion doesn't mean there's zombies literally everywhere now. Because I don't have the ammo for that. And running past them can be a pain in the butt. Also, I'm still fine. It looks like it's slightly yellowed, but uh, I'm still fine. Okay, so if I go through here... Steam room should be close by, right? I think. But we might need to go actually through the... Okay. I need to go through here anyway because I have uh, I have the ability to open those chains from earlier. Alright, I'm hoping and banking on... Oh, wait. There's going to be zombies right there. I don't have a way to block that. I have no ammo. <laughs> Wish I had ammo right now. I would definitely kill that guy. I don't think knifing him is going to work very well. I forgot about that window until we came in here. Um, well. I'm thinking, I'm, I'm rethinking my thoughts in my head right now. We can come back here later. The, both areas are probably going to have zombies, but I want to double check to make sure. Because the other area doesn't have zombies, I'd rather go that way first. Uh, because, you know, I have no ability to shoot. I mean, I have a shotgun shell. That's something. It's not going to kill anything, but which makes no sense to me. But, you know, we're just going to open pray there's not one. Okay. To be honest, this might lead to that room anyway. That's where I jump out, and this is where the kind of where the door is blocked. I hear a zombie, I think. Oh yeah, there's probably the guy at the window, but I'm not worried about him. What room? I was trying to look for the bathroom, right? Or whatever, that has the steam? Where is that at? Is that upstairs? No, that's not upstairs. Oh, it's... I bet it's through here, isn't it? It's back that way. I think. Am I wrong? I guess I should look on the map. Before I keep getting lost here this whole time. Um... So we go there, there's the records room, which has the club. There's that room, which we can't get to. Operations room, which is actually where we're at. Um, which, yeah, we can unlock that now, which leads to... If we could go through into the records room from there, we could get there. But this, this door leads out to us, which hopefully we could open if we open that. It'd be at least a shortcut back to there. But I don't want to go back... Because we were going through here... And through this hallway, there's the window that is open. Which we have no way to combat that. Where is this bathroom I remember so vividly? Safety deposit room. There's the dark room that's a safe spot. Um, West office. I know there was a bathroom somewhere, was there not? Shower room is upstairs. Okay. Okay, we can go up there then. But that's getting, gonna be full of zombies. I mean, we're gonna have to go past some zombies either way without any ammo. It's just gonna happen. So maybe I should have ran past those guys. Of course, you never know. Just, excuse me. Why do I hear a zombie behind me? Just gonna go over here. The safe room. And save. Because I'm gonna die soon. I can feel it in my bones. See, when I have no way to defend myself, that's when I start to get frightened. <laughs> that's when it starts to get a little scary. Just kind of the point. I understand that. I still don't like it. I swear I thought I heard one behind me. 
Oh, is there one upstairs? Is that what it is? Is that the one that was over there with the ammo earlier? Can I run past you? Nope. Okay. That's great. I'm in caution now. Hoping I could knife you, but I couldn't, which is awesome. She just gonna follow me in here? Can we turn off the power now? Okay, she's gonna follow me in here. I already know that. Gotta quickly look because that's definitely a zombie right there. That's definitely a zombie right there. I don't want to heal until I'm in the red because I only have one healer. And the green plus red is a full heal. I know that. At least in the old games it was. Oh, please don't tell me you're alive. You know what? Before I try to knife you... Ammo would be great. Oh, if I kept the other gunpowder. Only. I mean, I could go back for it, but... Why is there nothing in here? I guess it's better than a zombie in there. Okay, well, you're not coming to life for that, so... If you're gonna cheese me later... I wonder if I can kill you, because that lady didn't come back to life yet, either. Maybe she just wasn't a zombie yet. Knife you a bunch. Ugh, I cut your arm off? Yep, I did. How much is that hurting the knife? Uh, a little bit. I'm just gonna try to cut your head off, okay? Okay, you can't really cut their head off very well, so... I'm just gonna hope that does damage to him when he spawns as a zombie, which he probably will. Whoa, that's a... that's a dude. There's a lot of bodies in here and I don't like it. And that's not enough shotgun shells to combat it. Yeah, they're missing legs and things. There's another open window. Great. I'm tempted to go back down past the lady to get my gunpowder. Okay, yep, nope, well. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna go through this door now. We are gonna die. That's what I was worried about, was running into that. Oh, chose the scrape there. Hmm. Well then. I'm gonna go get my ammo now. Uh, cause, uh, yeah. I know the lady's here. We can't shoot her because we can't waste the ammo on it. I don't know where she went. Where did she go? I don't see her anywhere. There she is. Okay. <laughs> Alright, well, I wish she would go down the hallway that way a little bit more. So I can get to the safe zone a little easier without any damage taken. But here we go. I know she's going to turn around. Yeah, I'm going to go in here. You just leave me alone. That's fine, okay? All right. This is what I was dreading from the very beginning. was running into a liquor. Because the regular zombies already take an insane amount of damage. <laughs> this is where we eat all our healers as well. Because I've dropped healers earlier on. Which is definitely a negative. Should never have done that. This is where we also need the flashbang. Hopefully the flashbang doesn't affect me. Because if it does, that's going to suck. <laughs> I'm definitely going to flashbang myself. But before we go back up there, let's go ahead and again save. Because this is a lot of materials I brought with me to probably waste. Probably. Maybe. Who knows? Who really knows? Oh, there she is. Okay. Wow, she is very quick, and you can never knife them. Why can I not knife anything anymore? And then and now, as soon as I get hit by the liquor again, I'm gonna be in an up shit creek. Okay, so what I need here is that. That's what I'm gonna use on the liquor here. Which I assume is still here. Where is it? On the roof? On the ceiling? Oh, there it is. Hey, buddy. Uh. Uh. Can I choose you? Oh, 
Oh, left another claw mark. That's nice. Well, shotgun seemed to do little to nothing to him. Oh, that was a great waste of bullets. He's not there anymore, so he's over. Let's try this then. Did that do anything? Oh, hey, hey, hey. Kind of worked. Just. Do you die? Do you, do you die? I don't think you die. All right, well, I'm gonna die now and get all my ammo back, okay? I know I should, probably shouldn't, but we're gonna do this. Good night. Good night. Yeah. Get it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you don't need a gun, huh? Get some then. That's what I thought. All right, well. <laughs> Use our knife then. Um. Yeah, can we get some ammo? And no zombies? This seems like a pretty clean room. Could be wrong. A battery? Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and heal also because I don't trust being at low health at all. Should wait should wait until I was low, but I'm not sure if first aid spray is a hundred percent heal. Internal memo, memo, office supply, internal relocation notice. Heat resistance, uh, three number, combination safe, moved from Star's office. Second floor to west office, first floor. The combo is left 9, right 15, left 7. Please change the combo ASAP upon receipt. Uh, RPD facility maintenance department. So it's a... It's a where? It's first floor. Move to first floor west office. So it'll be on the side of the building on the first floor. Left 9, though. Usually they're up and down. Um... West office, first floor. So that's... That's where the cop office is, right? Okay, well, we can go back for that later. And then I'll look back at that for what it actually is. Hopefully... Okay, there's a... I hear a zombie. Could be wrong, but I think I hear a zombie. Maybe I'm just paranoid at this point. Probably just paranoid. Oh, yes, please. Sorry. You definitely need another one of these, because that helped a lot on the liquor. I figured it kind of would. Just kind of a guess. Does that have actually first aid in it? Yes, it does. Okay. My inventory is now full, though. And what is that? Special gunpowder? Of course it is, now that I've used my gunpowder. Um, I'm going to have to leave it there for a second. What's that sound? Oh, that's not creepy at all. Can I do something with that? Can I knife it? No? Okay. Gonna need a new knife soon as well. Even though I haven't technically lost either one. They're both kind of hurting. Video? Oh. Flame. Well, I guess I could just... Yeah, I could take it from Marvin. <laughs> What, what does it want me to do with this computer? What is missing? Oh, does it want me to put, like, the authentication something in there? Probably. What is in there? What is that? Is that a Desert Eagle? Oh, please, yes. Okay, well, we know where Desert Eagle is. That's... That's good to know. Everything is more frightening without ammo. I'll tell you that right now. Just everything. Uh... There's, there's nothing I can do here. I can just move on. I need to go back... And get my... What's out here? Is there something else out here? Hopefully not. A really bloody hallway. <laughs> so we know the liquor tore up all these guys. Gotta go back through the lady again. Uh, to put stuff away. So my inventory is not insanely full. So much backtracking this episode. Nothing I can really do about that, though. I kind of just... I need to optimize my inventory here. We got... I need to put the red herb up because it's useless. I need to put the battery up because I also don't have a use for it right now. Probably should put the flash grenade up unless I run into another liquor, but... Uh, then again, I should keep it on me in case I run into another liquor. 
put one first aid up, at least open up three slots, at least. Is she in that hallway again? Down there? Where is she? Hopefully way down at the end of the hallway. She's laying down over there for some reason. I don't know what she's doing, but she can stay over there, I don't care. I won't take any damage if she stays over there, so I'm good with it. Alright. Put that up. Oh, no, not combine. Put that up, and put that up. Alright. And we don't have any more gunpowder, right? I used it all just now. Correct. I was gonna save it for the shotgun, but I just couldn't do it. I had I had to give in. Give in to them temptations. Just stay right there and fuck you at the window. Okay, well. Let's get back to where we were. And I think what we're going to do is we're going to go into our little safe zone with the the police again. And we're going to go ahead and end the episode today, guys. So, uh, I know there's a lot of backtracking. I apologize, but must be done sometimes. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys for watching, and we will see you for the next episode of Resident Evil. See you later.